Hey there, welcome to my channel. My name is Kat, and today I'm really excited about this new product that I got in the mail. So I wanted to hop on and tell you a little bit about it. So I was doing a little bit of research on flea and tick products. Um, we always try to use something all natural, and I came across this Baltic Amber as collars for dogs to prevent um, flea and ticks from infesting your dogs. So I thought, let me do a little more research and see if it's legit. Um, and it sounds like it is, and it works for a good majority of people and their dogs. So I figured a chemical-free alternative to flea and tick products um, could be this Baltic Amber um, dog collar. I actually just got it in the mail um, about five minutes ago and got really excited, so I figured I would start recording and show it to you. So here is the package. It came um, postal service. It, I got it from Baltic Essentials in Plano, Texas. Um, it only took probably five days to get here. Um, I, like I said, I literally just got it in the mail, have not opened it. I bought four for all of the dogs. Um, my ideal with these is that we have old dogs, um, I don't want to put chemicals on them, and I want to see if these work. Um, here is, I got the 8 inch ones for all of them, um, and they claim to be 100% natural Baltic Amber, which is what you're supposed to get is the Baltic Amber, not just Amber. Um, and it says it gets rid of, or it prevents uh, fleas and ticks. So let's open this up. Oh, look at that. Grace is over here checking us, checking it out. She's curious. So I'm gonna open one up and go ahead and slap it on Gracie here. Since she's being nosy. Um, I did give all of the dogs baths. Um, on what this is Tuesday that I'm recording this and got this. Um, they got baths on Saturday, so they're all clean and ready to go. When I give them their bi weekly baths, I will um, take these off for that. I like that it is a um, metal buckle and a leather strip here. I think when I get them fitted, I can probably, if needed, cut um, the excess leather off. Let's go ahead and just, I'm just going to move this over here to little Grace since she's here. Now my dogs do not normally wear collars, so this might be something for them to get used to. They usually only wear collars or harnesses when they go for walks. Um, might loosen it a little bit more. Um, it doesn't really say how tight it should be. I'm giving it, looks like this one fits Grace perfectly. So Gracie is on the third loop here, the third dot here. They're really cute. They go with their, <laughs> with their coat. <laughs> um, but I'm, you know, giving a little bit of space here. As you can see, I can put, if you can see through her hair, I can put two fingers there and she's good to go. Yeah, Grace. Um, and you can't, honestly, Gracie, you can't really tell that it's on her. Um, I'm curious to know how long it will last um, or how long it claims to be um, up to about a year or so. Um, depending on the dog, I guess. I think it looks nice with her color. All right, Grace, you're good. No? Okay. So let's... Oliver still needs a haircut. Um, yes, Grace, it's the same thing. So um, I may give him his haircut and then put his on him, but Matilda will get hers on her. Morris still needs, sorry if you can't hear me through the 
the wrapper. So it looks like this is just string, a pretty thick string. If you can see that. Um, I will update you in about a month and let you know let you know um, how they're doing with flea and tick prevention. Let's go ahead and put this on Miss Matilda if she lets me. Matilda is our oldest child. <laughs> Matilda is on the second little loop here. As you can see it looks adorable on her. Um, I'm hoping that it doesn't interfere with their their hair or their ear fringe, but if it does, you know, it kind of is what it is. None of them are showing, so I'm not overly concerned about that. Thank you so much for watching. I am going to keep you updated on how well these work. Um, check back in about a month. Um, when I do that video, I will go ahead and put a link in this video at the end to the new video so you can you know, see the update. Of course, if you subscribe, you'll get an email um, if you turn that notification bell on about the update on the collars and any of our other videos that we post. So don't forget to like and subscribe. If you have any questions about um, this Baltic Amber uh, flea and tick prevention, do let me know in the comments. Um, it's a very new concept for me. Previously we had been using um, all natural flea and tick topicals, so I'm kind of in this new phase of of these collars with you. Or if you know anything about them, let me know. I'm very curious. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you next time.